What's up guys? This is Kyle from Vapor Hut, driven by you, fueled by vapor. And today I'm gonna to be showing you a new product on the market, the screw off. So the screw off basically serves two purposes. The first one is that it allows you to change your tanks extremely quickly. And the second is it preserves the life of your 510 connection. No longer are you constantly tightening and untightening the tank onto the top of your mod. Basically, you just have this little base that acts like an intermediary between the device and the tank. And then with a little 120 degree turn, your tank is on. Now the diameter of the screw off is roughly 25 millimeters, so it will sit perfectly flush with some of those oversized tanks like the TFV4. The primary function of this I see as being more geared towards the testers in vape shops. It's just way easier for someone to screw off and screw on the tank they're looking to try rather than accidentally grabbing the tank above the base and dripping juice everywhere. The other really cool thing about the screw off is because it's basically making your threading recessed, your tank will finally stand on flat surfaces. Tanks have a tendency of rolling around and so they've actually made little stands where the 510 just pops right into a little hole and the tank will sit upright. Well, with the screw off, you're good. You can just set down your tank, grab the next one you wanna try, screw it on and you're ready to go. So the screw off is a very cool idea. It definitely extends the size of your device as a whole. Um, it does add a little bit to the weight and I see these more for the tester units. But otherwise, if you have a lot of tanks and you tend to use a lot of tanks, definitely look into the screw off. And the screw off comes with two caps, so you can have two tanks ready to go, and one base. So that's my take on the screw off from cloudedpower.com. Well, this has been Kyle from Vapor Hut, driven by you, fueled by vapor. Have a great day, guys. When you pass out.